welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And uh, one question that pops up regularly, it popped up again uh, in the last um, couple of days. So I talked about the um, Google Chrome updates for security, including the famous zero day that is ex exploited by bad guys. And the question that comes to mind for a lot is, okay, so you say that, you know, Brave and Edge and all the other browsers that are Chromium based will update eventually uh, in the next few days. Doesn't that make them vulnerable? It does to a certain extent. It does to a certain extent because, yes, that means that they have security flaws that are not fixed, but the um, way that Google handles the security flaws, especially the very important one, is that it waits a little while before it will disclose the exact nature of the flaw. That means bad guys or hackers, um, for the ones that you have not exploited yet, still don't know what is the problem. So that, you know, they'll have to wait for the security bulletin. But um, in the case of a zero day exploited in the wild, that's a little different problem. Yes, it means that every browser for the few days that they will not have updated are going to be vulnerable and it's going to be a problem. So um, definitely there is something there. Now, you know, in the few days that this is going to happen and the, the update's going to happen in general, it's going to be okay. And remember that a lot of those flaws are exploited on shady websites. It doesn't happen very often on, you know, standard good websites that people go to. Um, because these websites are checked for the code. They're updated regularly. They are meant to be um, as safe as possible. So it really is in the case where you would go into websites that you shouldn't go to. Um, you know, illegal downloads or porn sites, stuff like that. That's where the danger is, particularly. Uh, but you never know. And, you know, sometimes that little, you know, uh, auntie website where they show you cooking tips or stuff like that, it can happen that some of them can be um, actually a problem because they might not have been updated in a while and they have security flaws. But in general, it's really the shady websites that are the biggest problems with this. Um, so the security is a hazard is there definitely, but um, if you stay on standard websites that you go to every day and stuff like that, it's very limited. But it, yeah, the the simple answer to that question is technically yes. The uh, vulnerabilities, as long as they're not fixed, does increase the risk uh, for any problems with security on a, a PC or any device, as long as the updates are not there. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.